I'm back. everybody I'm back with a quick update now I know I have been cranking out videos like I normally do especially the ballistic gel testing uh, had some personal stuff going on that prevented that and then also just trying to get the timing down with my friends that let me shoot over there we are on track so far to come out this weekend and do some ballistic gel testing the normal deer setups uh, with deer hide meat and gel we'll be running the Norma tip strike and bond strike for that testing and then also with these bad boys. Now, to explain these, I get a ton of requests about guys wanting to know about match bolts and varmints. They see what it does on elk and deer and moose and everything, but they want to know, can I take my regular deer rifle with one of these bullets like an ELD match, A-tips, burgers, TMKs, and how will that perform on a varmint if I'm running either a smaller cartridge or if I'm running my regular you know, deer cartridge? Can you do it? Now, I was already ordering some ballistic gel from uh, Clear Ballistics for this testing, replenishing my stock, and I found these. They just started these. It's a rabbit and a squirrel, and I thought, man, that's gonna be perfect. I don't have to try to makeshift something out of ballistics gel, and so I'm gonna use this, and we're gonna do some testing with that. So deer setup with the Normas, and regular setup for this. We'll probably do A-tips and ELD match, and probably some Sierras, but have a lot of fun with this. Now, I'm going to do a couple shots in each. Normally, I don't. I don't want to mess with the structural integrity of the gel, and I only shoot it once. But with these being smaller and I can't remold them because I don't have a mold for them, we're going to have some fun. So I'll be doing headshots with them and then standard uh, through the vitals. Now, I'm also going to have some fun, and I'm going to shoot it long ways. Now, that's not something that I normally do. It's not a very good shot, but we're going to have a lot of fun with this. And after we do the initial testing, we're just going to show kind of every shot what it'll do. So it's going to be really fun. Now, we have had a lot going on, as I mentioned. I got the podcast up and running. I got a bunch of new equipment, microphones, interface, all kinds of stuff. And so if you guys want to listen to the podcast, description below, I'll put a link to that in um, Buzzsprout and uh, Spotify. And so you guys can go check that out there, talk about a lot of different stuff. Also got a whole new lighting system for the videos just because i mean the other ones weren't bad but quite honestly it's very bright and so i got more of a soft light setup so i'm not getting blinded but you're still getting a uh, a good lighting setup and you guys can see everything i'm also going to be doing videos i just did the breakdown of the 875 yard uh elk shot with a 308 I'm gonna continue going down that line too. There's plenty of videos I get sent where they're controversial and I'll be breaking those down and going and showing evidence of what I'm saying, breaking down what's good, what's bad, and trying to debunk that because they get in these internet forums and groups and it seems like everybody is all of a sudden an internet expert at long range. It's just kind of like the internet. Everybody's a medical professional one second everybody's a cop the next section everybody's a sniper in the next section everybody's a hunter and understands long range and it just it's a bunch of nonsense so i'm trying to utilize this stuff these breakdowns to help clear up misinformation so you guys can understand a little bit better on that and just a lot going on so i appreciate everybody's patience thank you again jared for sending me those bullets a buddy of mine sent me the normal bullets to test very excited. Those have been on the list for quite a while. And we got more bullets coming too. So I hope you've enjoyed these videos. To everybody that's new, welcome. Uh, thanks for subscribing. For everybody, including the old people and the new people, I hope you're enjoying the content. Um, now, I do try to be very active in the comments. Sometimes I forget. I'll look at something and forget about it or I'm answering several questions at once and I think I've got to you. So if 
you've asked a question and I haven't responded in a reasonable amount of time, just comment again so I'll get that and say, hey, you, did you fret me? And you know, I'll get to you. I try my best, but there's a lot going on and I sometimes, you know, enough stuff's going on, I think, because I've looked at it, that I might have responded to that person when I actually didn't. So uh, I try to get to everybody and help everybody out in the comments. So, you know, if you need help, go ahead and ask. I'll do my best to square you away. And, you know, I hope you enjoy the videos. I'll post these gel tests up as soon as I can get them shot and filmed and all that fun jazz. So everybody be safe out there. Happy hunting. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and turn on notification bell so you won't miss out on any future video. And happy hunting!